Give and go. Take over. Remember, it's an exchange of torch. It's not a pass. Fake over. Person with the ball drive at the other person. Double pass. Freeze, take a knee. So a double pass is this. You're going to be the star of the show. Stand up. You're going to love it. Can I have the ball? So this is my uh, center forward personality. Go away from me. Perhaps we're playing against the flat back three or flat back four. Stay there. This is the movement you're going to achieve. You're going to check towards the ball. And instead of staying in this frame, as you receive, you're going to make your body long and your arm will come up. The pass you play back to me let it be with the outside of the foot that's closest to me. So we're talking about body shape. So it's your check, initially at this plane, and then change to this plane. So the pass you play will be the outside of your right foot. As soon as you've laid it off, spin and run that way as quick as you can. Ready? Check. Turn. And turn it. No, no, no. Freeze. You're going to play it back to me and then spin and run. Okay? Again, back to me. Check. Change your body shape. Lay it off and spin. Off you go. Run, 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 run. Ah, freeze. So it, while the double pass should come spinning over her right shoulder with a little bit of backspin that takes her to the goal. Come to me. Run to me. Keep coming. Don't shy. I'm not biting. This business of body shapes, so if I'm the defender who's marking you and you don't get this body shape, and you're nice and tight, what will I do as a defender? I'll kick you, won't I? Because I think I can win the ball. So if you get really big, now the ball's on that foot, how can I get that ball? I can't, can I? It's impossible. I'm not that long. Yeah? So now you're going to play in that body shape. Recognize the body shapes you need to be in. Go, pass and move. Double pass. Somebody's got to run away. Somebody's got to run away. Big passes over people's shoulders. Let them turn. Freeze, take a knee. So for coaches out there, the problem is now is we're teaching the double pass. And I'm the forward checking and I've been torturing a back four. What sort of physical pressure am I under? I've got some six foot gorilla who's trying to kill me. So as I receive in this body shape, I'm about to be crippled. What's the quality of my pass back going to be? Probably troubled. It may be straight to my feet. Just, so I've got nothing to do now other than clip it with the outside of the foot. So we're back to the technical training again. Then we break it down. Go big for me. Go big, go big. Keep going. Try and avoid them having a stationary ball, a moving ball, and then you're just trying to curl passes with the outside of your foot. Curl it back for me. Outside of your foot. I know, big time. Nerves, go on. It's a great effort, and that's where we realize now, that's where we need to focus as a coaching. We're going to break down technique. When you play your double passes, try and play that longer pass with the outside of your strong foot. Yes? Go, pass and move. You were brilliant. Quicker. War. So we're always in that competitive cauldron. Battle for it. Battle. It's a fight. Take each other on. If you've beat her once, turn and beat her again. It's vital for any two-player combination. We've got tackers willing to drive at people with the ball. Freeze. Got the ball. You won. Well done. Go. Pass and move again.
Freeze, bring it in. Who's the first three? Who's the first three? How quickly can you get here? One, two, brilliant. Wow, you want to learn. You're doing a great job. You're going to leave all the soccer balls here. You're going to run and grab a quick drink and try not to be the last.